Welcome to Lake Cumberland Amateur Radio Association. You can find us at lcara.net, on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram. If you're enjoying the videos we're producing here at Elcara, please help our club out by hitting that subscribe button. Also, give us some feedback on our videos. Click the like button, share with anybody who may find it interesting, and be sure and hit the bell icon to make sure you get notified of the next video release. We're with Bob Greenberg here at Hamcation 2020, and I'm at one of the booths that is, to be quite honest, is becoming uh, really exciting because the type of radio they've got, the RF, uh, RF, RF Finder, finder. Yeah. Um, well, I'll let Bob explain what it does. Uh, Bob, what's really, what's what's the thing about this radio that makes it so interesting? Well, it's kind of cool. It's um, it's a 2 meter 440 DMR radio, DMR FM. And um, it never needs a code plug, so anywhere you go on Earth, it just yeah. works. Yeah. So you don't have to program it? Ever. Ever? No, we don't even have a software cable or... None of that? No, no, no. We just, so, we just run the R Finder app. We're so used to going into one of the uh, the companies that sells software for programming radios and making sure we get the right cable. We yeah, don't have no, to do that anymore. No, no. It just works. So can you demonstrate it a little bit there? Yeah, sure. Well, um... Uh, this is the, uh, first of all, let me go back. I mean, it's a regular Android cell phone. So it's Android. All right. right. So you see we're on 4G LTE. We're on, right. This one's on T-Mobile. Um, and if you uh, touch the R Finder app, it comes up. And it never needs to be programmed because it knows your GPS position. And then it shows you the machines around you. So, so that's the magic right there is the GPS locator. Right. And then similar to like going to repeater book, but it's right there on the device. Yes. Well, in the R Finder. Understood. Yeah, right. So, I mean, there are other repeater directories, but we believe that ours is, uh, it, it has the most complete DMR data on Earth. DMR data, that's right. Yeah, we gather it from all the different DMR uh, uh, networks around 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 the globe. Right. Put it in here and, you know, for instance, I went to the, went to the ham fest in uh, Avila, Spain, and they were setting up a, a Brandmeister machine on Friday night. And on Saturday morning, I just pulled down on the list and the Brandmeister machine. It was already in there. It was there. It just popped up. That so, is really cool. Yeah, actually, it was just like literally like that. Just pulled down on the list and whoop, showed up. So, and this happens all. I mean, I go to a lot of ham fests, so or you know, uh, you know, radio events in general. So it happens a lot. But you know, you'll just see something show up in the morning, and there it is. Understood. You start using it. So. Um, I'm just going to look for a DMR machine. Uh, here's one nearby. Okay, so if I want to connect to this one, I just touch the uh, the repeater in the right. list. They send a radio, and uh, this repeater owner has properly documented his uh, talk of time slot combos. I can just pick one. So if I take Florida um, uh, statewide, and that's it. So okay. it's literally that simple to program the radio. No, it's really like just choosing a frequency you're going to use. Exactly. Um, we also have the ability um, to save local memory. So, for instance, if you use a hotspot often with the same talk route uh, time slot, uh, it's easy enough to do that. So I can say save to memory and either pick one of my existing zones that I've created on the device manually, or I can add a new zone and then just store it. I have memories and uh, local memories. So, for instance, if I want to choose a, like I have in here a, a local simplex, the standard simplex 441. If I want to grab it, I just touch it, and oops. and it changes over to that frequency. Right. Okay. So pretty straightforward, pretty easy to uh, uh, to use. We have some options. You can silence the uh, the chirp, so you don't have to disturb other people while you're. Uh, transmitting, turning um, admin mode on and off, right. putting it into a roam mode. Now it's a semi-automatic roam, so as I change frequencies, it doesn't request a talk group time slot from me. It just changes machines. So, for instance, <coughs> excuse me, if I'm driving through an area that's consistent machines, like Switzerland, for instance, has all Brandmeister machines. Okay, so I'm driving through Switzerland and they have solid coverage machines all over the place. So as I'm driving along, I'm losing my previous machine, I just grab the next machine, 
It doesn't ask me for a talk of time or time, and I can continue the same conversation. So it's very, very nice. Shortly, we're working on right now, um, we just got a prototype of pulling the Ambi datagrams into Android, and shortly we're putting the hotspot functionality in. It won't be a hotspot, it won't repeat another radio, but it'll be an endnote, and I'll right. be the endnote for DMR Brandmeister, and then we'll move on to uh, uh, DMR Plus, TGIF, um, uh, C4FM, for instance, any of the Ambi 2 style pro uh, 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 codecs uh, protocols, we'll be able to uh, put that IP function in this. Very cool. So, yeah, so we're working on that right now. Um, so, what else do you want to see? I Anything think that's else? pretty good, Bob. We Is just wanted to keep start? it short. But right. yeah, absolutely. This radio is, uh, like I said, is it's in the circles that I'm running in and, and some of the uh, guys where you can literally take a radio anywhere and not have to program it. Never. I, that's it, that to us is huge. Never. I landed at Ben Gurion Airport in Tel Aviv. In Tel Aviv. Yeah. Pulled the radio out. I hit a machine on Rosh Chaim. It's a mountain about 15 miles south. Opened it up. I was driving to the coast towards Netanya, and I just started losing the other machine. The Rosh Chaim machine just opened up Netanya, and you know, but same kind of thing. Like right. We've had this happen at you know in, in London and in. in uh, in, uh, in Spain, I mean, anywhere we go on Earth, it just works. And it's, you know, around the United States, too, of course. You know, here in Orlando, I just pulled the radio out, it works. So. Absolutely. We're having a great time. Thanks, everybody, for your support on the app. Please download the R Finder app. And uh, your uh, uh, support over the years has made it possible for us to, to create this fine piece of equipment. And thank you all for your support. Bob, we want to thank you for giving us a few minutes of your time. Oh, thank you. 73s, everybody. Thanks.